And, uh, I think the kids are looking forward to the game. They're ready to play. I saw that Dijon had a boot on. Is that just to kind of take some weight off that foot, or is that off an injury? Oh, no, he's okay. He's fine. You expect him to start for the game? Oh, yeah. No, there are no issues. Hey, hey with Dijon, what, what do you think? What kind of player do you think he could be at the next level? Gomes? Do you, think he fits? Yeah, what do you, you know, I think he's kind of a... I, th I think, you know, what guys are looking at him as is a safety and a guy who can kind of do a lot of things. I mean, he's, uh, you know, there are a lot of people that are think he's going to be really valuable, and uh, I agree. I, I think, you know, it all depends on the team, the type of system we're dealing with, and, uh, you know, a lot of teams like him more than others, you know. And, but, uh, you know, he's played up closer to the line, but I think he'll be more of a safety at the next level. Hey, what's this week been like for Coach Eckler being his last week kind of around the program with you guys? You know, like business as usual. He's... Uh, you know, he's just doing his job, and uh, I think he's, uh, I'm sure he's, you know, I've been through it. I've been in this situation before, the same one and that he's in. So, uh, you know, it'll probably be emotional for him. This staff has been together three years without a change. I mean, to just talk about how close you guys have become, um, and this will be the first guy to, to, to move on to a, you know, a better opportunity. Yeah, but, you know, you, you, you want your guys to get better opportunities and to move on, and that's the case. And uh, it was, uh, you know, we're all for it. And, and, uh, you know, I mean, he's been with me now for seven years. So it's, uh, you know, he and, you know, he's been a valuable part of the staff. And, but it's time to move on and uh, for him and uh, we're happy for him. For, 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 for you, I mean, you basically kind of showed him the ropes. He's kind of cut his teeth under you. What has his progression been like from seven years ago to today? I mean, it's, he's come a long way. You know, like uh, when I got him, he was a, you know, when I first met him, he was a GA. and. And I was actually considering getting out of it at that point and talked them into, you know, sticking it out. And, and you, you, it's just it's rewarding for me to see guys, you know, who work hard and to, to see them achieve and to see them, uh, you know, reach his goals. And, you know, I mean, and this is the next step for him, and uh, I think he'll do a heck of a job. Have you even thought about, at this point, filling that? I mean, who? I have a, I have a, a list in mind of guys that I'm – that I uh, – I have a lot of confidence in and, and guys that I know and um, that's easy but I but I haven't done anything with that yet I, it'll be a while before I do well that, you guys are going to the Navy base today can you just talk about the respect that your your team has had for Tyrone Foy as he is with you for the last game now and, and uh, kind of fitting that you're going well he's today. yeah he's been great to have around <clears throat> you know he's been a leader a, a true team guy and I um, mean he really epitomizes the you know the guys that we're going to be running into over there at the ship and and, uh, you know, obviously we have a tremendous amount of respect for him and really for anybody. Hey, hey, with, with the rematches, Coach, I'm, we talked about it a couple of weeks ago. You, you mentioned that it kind of reminded you of NFL days. But does one side have, a, have an edge? I mean, does the loser, no. you think, have an advantage? Just cause it's going to be one on the field on uh, what day? Thursday, whatever yeah. day that is. And, uh, you know, what happened in the past, that, that will have no bearing on what happened in this game, what happens in this game. Do you, do you draw back at all on those experiences? Like, do you, do you say like this is what I did back then, or are you just approaching it like I haven't? We haven't really talked about it. Yet. Okay. Our guys understand what the deal is, and uh, we'll visit about it here over the next forty-eight hours. And um, our guys will be ready to play. Hey, and not necessarily talk about his health, but just Taylor Martinez's progress since the since the Big Twelve game. I mean, how how's he done in the in the few practices that you have? He's and done well. He's done well. He's uh, you know I think he's getting better. I think he's feeling better. Uh, and, uh, you know, I mean, it's in that next step. You know, I think he's come. He's been through a lot. I mean, yeah. he's a – I mean, I think, you know, kind of gets lost in the shuffle a little bit. That this guy's a freshman. I've, I mean, a, a first-year starter. And uh, he's been through a lot. He's learned a lot. And, uh, you know, it, You know, all those experiences are going to make you better and stronger, hopefully, over time. I think this is that's the case with Taylor. He's still going to rely on Rex's versatility, though, um, running the wildcat mm -hmm. a little bit. And, um, I'm sure. Maybe you might see a little bit of that. I don't know. We uh, we have uh, we have a lot of things we can do, and uh, you know, we'll, we'll see how the game goes. Do you is this a time maybe where a guy like Taylor, a young guy, could you know during these bull practices, can kind of step back and kind of size up size up things a little bit, and get a get a breath a little bit. Well, you hope so. You hope to you know you like I said you know you, you get into a, a long season and. You go through a lot. I mean, really, all these quarterbacks, they go through a lot. I mean, Cody Green's been through a lot. And, uh, yeah. you know, it gives you a chance to, see, like you say, step back, evaluate, and uh, and hopefully think about all the experiences you had and, and let them make you better over time. 
Is he, is he definitely your guy? Is he your starter on Thursday? Yeah, Taylor will start Thursday. Okay. Thanks.